10 Things We Love About the Ducati Scrambler Desert Sled Burning up the dirt Taking on the wild elements on two wheels Feeling like a desert racer Bring on the adventure The Ducati Scrambler Desert Sled might be the best scrambler motorcycle you can buy. It looks mean, mirroring the tough desert conditions of the desert sled heritage. When you see the suspension setup, you know you can leave the highways behind and hit the uninhibited trails. Some may say that it is one of those ugly off-road motorcycles that are great fun to ride. But hitting the rough country is not always pretty and certainly needs something more than the shine and glimmer of a seductive bike. It needs the reinforced frame like the Ducati Desert Sled. It doesn't hurt that the backstory to the Desert Sled harks back to the golden days of desert racing. When you can back up a great bike with a championship moment, then you know you are onto a winner. You just need to look back at Jordan Graham's victory at the Mint 400. Let's take a look at all the things we love about the Desert Sled. 10. The 60s, Steve McQueen and the Sun Scorched Deserts. Cast your mind back to the 60s. California. Movie stars. The Great Escape, when Bud Eggins, the stunt double for Steve McQueen, made that jump that forever has become etched into cinematic memory. Steve McQueen, with his famous obsession with racing and his motorcycle collection. The Desert Sled was named after McQueen's 1963 Triumph Bonneville Desert Sled. Now fast forward. Ducati with their Desert Sled, taking their inspiration from that era of desert racing. The rise of the British sled, with a tow rope on board, hit the scene from the 50s to the 70s. The two-stroke dirt bike made waves in the 70s, taking on desert racing with unbridled enthusiasm, as the 360 Yamahas, among some of the most intimidating dirt bikes to ever come from Yamaha, along with the 400 Husqvarna's, tore up the dirt. They were wild times, and Ducati wanted to capture the spirit of that era. 9. Taking on the Desert Sled with the shadows of past sleds cast over this new era, the Ducati Desert Sled excites us. We may not have the tow rope to accompany us, but we have a bike that reflects something of the early scramblers, with its design, yet the spirit of the outdoors with its wildness, and with the limited edition Ducati Scrambler Desert Sled commemorating the 2020 Mint 400 victory, it reinforces everything the Desert Sled represents. It was in 2014 when we first laid eyes on the Ducati Scrambler at the Intermo Motorcycle Show. The Ducati Desert Sled came to our attention in 2016, along with the Scrambler Cafe Racer. When the Desert Sled first emerged, it even came with its own range of apparel and accessories. With its reinforced frame and the suspension setup, its versatility and off-road performance, it was going to have its own identity apart from the original Ducati Scrambler. 8. Ready for the beaten track? The reinforced chassis makes the Ducati Scrambler Desert Sled one of those bikes that can handle anything that comes its way, whether it be an off-road track or a desert trail. With the extra durability, the steel trellis frame is built tough. We just need to look at the swing arm to see that it is not only longer but beefier. But that is what we want from a bike like this. The Desert Sled is made to take the knocks that come with a rough terrain. 7. Off-Road Settings The Ducati Desert Sled is packed with adjustable Kayaba suspension with the 46. Mmm! Fork At the rear, you will find the side-mounted rear shock, that is compression, rebound, and preload adjustable. The Desert Sled also comes with an extended rear fender and high front mudguard. It includes the variable, cross-section handlebar. It has the taller seat at 860. Mm. Accommodating for the suspension and reinforced frame, but there is the lower option of 840. Mm. Available. 6. Powering a Desert Sled We remember the 803 cubic centimeters that powered the original Scrambler. Well, the Desert Sled shares an air-cooled 803 cubic centimeters engine, based on the Ducati Monster 796. The Desert Sled's L-Twin produces a sweet 75 horses and 50 FTLBS of torque, at 5,750 RPM. While the Desert Sled bears the same engine as the Scrambler, the suspension difference makes is more of an off-roader, as does the higher cross-braced handle Barvia. This L-Twin gives the punch needed to take on the elements.
The Desert Sleds engine is matched with a six-speed gearbox. But being among one of the best scrambler motorcycles you can buy, you wouldn't expect any less from the Desert Sled. 5. Burning Rubber When you are navigating a harsh and unforgiving terrain, you want to be assured that the wheels are up for the challenge. The Ducati Desert Sled has a 19-inch front wheel and a 17-inch rear, proven to stand the test of the off-road. As you can imagine, the brake setup is more than capable to handle the ride. The front brake is a single 330 mm. disc with the Brembo 4-piston caliper, while the rear brake is a 245 mm. rear disc with the Brembo single-piston caliper. 4. Lights, Controls, Action The Desert Sled includes dual-channel Bosch cornering ABS. You will also find the convenience of handlebar switch controls. The dash is set up for ease and rider friendliness. The latest Desert Sled shines with its sparkling blue aesthetic with the red and white to match. The blue livery being a tribute to the 80s enduro bikes. The LED headlight fitted with the guard completes the package. 3. Jordan Graham, the Desert Sled, and the Hooligan Open. The Min 400 is an off-road race that set Ducati Desert Sled fans alight. It is a prestigious event. Being first set up in 1968, the Mint 400 is also the oldest off-road race. Taking place in March, the race is held in Las Vegas. Now enter Jordan Graham and Ricky Diaz to the scene. In 2020, their modified Scrambler Ducati Desert sleds tore up the field in one of the new classes, the Hooligan Open. Ricky Diaz never finished the race due to damage to his desert sled, but Jordan Graham ended up claiming first place. 2. Desert Sled Fast House On the back of Jordan Graham's win, we welcomed the Desert Sled Fast House, a collaboration between Ducati Scrambler and Fast House, an American clothing brand. It was a limited edition model with only 800 available. The black and red paint job make this ride shine. The limited edition Ducati Sled Fast House has the distinguished livery. With the 803 cubic centimeters engine powering the fast house, this bike has all the sweet perks of the desert sled, including the adjustable Kayaba suspension, the mudguards, and headlight. The fast house also includes its own line of apparel as a cherry on this sweet cream cake. 1. Taking the adventure next level. It doesn't get much better than getting out into the wild and exploring on two wheels. But how much will you pay? The latest Ducati Scrambler Desert Sled starts at $11,995 MSRP. But if you want to go next level and get your hands on the limited edition Fast House, it will start at $12,295 MSRP, $300 more than the Desert Sled. Burning up the off-road tracks is more accessible than ever, especially with the range of dirt bikes. The Desert Sled offers the reinforced frame, awesome suspension setup and all the perks we want for burning up the trails. Everything we crave for a great adventure.